Hello, hello, hello. It's Granny Janae here. Thank you so much for tuning into my channel today. In today's video, I'm going to be showing you how to do a plan with me in your bullet journal using just stickers. So if you're interested in seeing how that looks, please be sure to stay tuned. All right, so again, thank you so much for tuning into my channel today. If you are new here, then I'd like to welcome you to the channel. And if you're returning, thank you so much for being a faithful subscriber. I truly, truly, truly appreciate all of your love, support, and definitely those comments. I, that's like one of my favorite things to do is to read the comments down below. So please be sure to use that comment box if you have any questions or any suggestions. I absolutely love to hear about them. So in today's video, like I said, I am going to be doing another bullet journal video. Um, this one, I am using a separate bullet journal. I know um, the one that I use currently is the white with the holographic detail. So I pulled out this other bullet journal. Um, I actually saw a video from Creative Minds Coffee Grinds, I believe is her name. I'll link the channel below where she created what she called a junk drawer journal. And I just thought that was really, really, really cool because junk drawer is a little hard for me to say over and over and over again, I decided to just name mine my swatch book. Um, and so in this book, I have literally swatched my entire stationary collection. And I'm going to be doing like different spreads, trying them out, um, trying out different lettering and different fonts, different doodles, maybe. Um, this is my very first bullet journal experience. So I'm not necessarily a doodler and I have basic preschool teacher handwriting in my opinion I'm not really like a you know professional hand letterer either so I'm just kind of tipping my feet in to see um, you know what I like and what I really don't like without having to necessarily commit that fully into the bullet journal that I do use from day to day so this book I felt like is perfect to experience that I can use the exact same Archer and Oliver olive product so I know what the pages feel like I know what mediums I can use in my other one which ones bleed and don't bleed and you know all of those things um, that are very important and um, I'm able to do that in here and then can kind of commit to that in my actual bullet journal later if I choose to do so um, and I think this will also be really good just to kind of keep ideas for next year's journal in as well I have the brain dump section and stuff so I've been writing like little notes of things that I want to do, but you know, writing a note and actually seeing it are two totally different things. So this will be my swatch book, practice book, <laughs> if you will. Um, so in today's video, like I said, I'm going to be showing um, all those other beginner journalers like me, how I can make a bullet journal spread using just stickers. Um, because like I said, I'm not necessarily a doodler um, and I'm not a calligrapher of by any means. So I wanted to see if I could make a cute spread using literally just stickers, a couple um, markers for color, and that's that. Um, and so hopefully it'll work out <laughs> the way that it has worked out in my mind. Um, and that, you know, anybody that is new to bullet journaling that doesn't necessarily want to, um, you know, draw or anything like that, hopefully you can kind of find some value in using some stickers that you may already have. Like, because I have been in the planning community for a very long time, um, I have tons of stickers. I even make stickers so i have even more stickers probably than other people um and so i decided this year to really put all of those things to use and to just stop hoarding them because at this point i'm just i just have stickers just coming out of my eyeballs for no reason at all so um you will definitely be seeing me incorporating a lot of stickers not only ones for my shop but also ones that i just have that fit with the theme um that i am doing for um you know each of my monthly layouts so anyway, I'm going to go ahead and stop talking and go ahead and start planning. Hope you like it. Again, if you do, please be sure to leave a thumbs up. 
definitely leave me a comment and let me know what you think about it. And I would love for you to subscribe to my channel if you have not already done so and share, share, share. Let's get this channel to a thousand subscribers so that we can continue to grow and move forward. I appreciate your support and I will talk to you again on the other side. Thank you.
right in there you have it my completed bullet journal spread using only stickers thank you so much for watching and as always have a good day friends goodbye